वेलकम टू दया केमिस्ट्री यूट्यूब चैनल कर्नाटका सेट टू थाउजेंड फोर्टीन केमिकल सैंस पेपर टू फिफ्टी क्वेश्चन वित् एक्सप्लेनेटरी आंसर्स पार्ट वन सैक्लोपेटाडनल ग्रूप इन सीपी फोर टी ई आर आल एन फै टू एन वन अंड टू एन फै आल एन वन वन एन वन अंड थ्री एन फै हिर् is a titanium central metal ion this is cp group there are four cp group here two cp group are attached at the ring center uh, uh, at the edge that is n1 this is n1 and this is n1 eta1 here the two bond are attached at the n5 is a center of the ring n5 n5 so the correct answer is 2n1 and 2n5 option b is correct second question identify the species isolable to ch ch group the ch group is a carbine group the four an options are given here you see co co3 fragment is isolable since each of them possess three similar orbitals and can contribute three electrons for cluster bonding here the bh bond ch bond and fe co4 these are all isolable and here ch p phosphorus co co3 these are all isolable here b and d is isolable with ch2 option b option b and option d you see it is uh, isolable with ch2 methylene group and uh, option c is isolable with ch3 group that is methyl group so option b c d are ruled out and option a is the correct answer here i have given the uh, Three options for uh, which CH, CH two and CH three, which is isolable. Third question: the coordination number and the geometry of cerium CeNO three six two minus this complex cerium nitrate anion is a icosahedron anion which builds a cubic network with a coordination number 12 here the coordination number is 12 so option b is correct it's a icosahedron structure with a coordination number 12 fourth question f19 nmr spectrum of pf5 gives two singlet doublet and a triplet Two doublets and three singlets. A doublet. Actually, PF five disproportionate at room temperature in solid state as PF four plus and PF six minus. This was the uh, structure which have chemical shift at ninety five under two eighty ppm with doublet. So it gives a doublet. Answer D is correct. Next question. Question number five. The metal present in carboxy peptides was zinc. So answer C. Here in question number six. The STOX number of B five H nine is a boron hydride. Here you will see the answer. You see. is a structure of b5h9 here in in this stox number bhp bond is given as s bb bond that is bq bond is given as t and the bb bond b square bond is given as y and bhbh that is bh2 bond is given as x so the in this structure you see this
in this structure you see there is a 4 bhp bond so 1 2 3 and 4 there are 4 bhp bond and there are 1 bbb bond that is a b cube bond that is 1 b cube bond and there are 2 bb bond there are 2 bb bond here 1 2 there are 2 bb bond and there are 0 that is no bh2 bond there is no bh2 bond okay hence the stox number of b5 h9 is 4120 seventh question which among the following is planar pnf24 pnbr24 pncl24 pnme24 here is a tetrameric fluoropospine fluoropospine here you see pncl4 structure this is a puckered structure and pnf2 is a planar structure hence answer a is correct here you see this was a puckered structure this was not planar and this was not also a planar because of bulky group and uh, this was not also a planar these are all puckered structure and uh, pnf2 is a planar structure hence answer a is correct question number eight Identify the strongest acid HClO, HClO2, HClO3 and HClO4. Acidity decides the basis of oxidation state on the central atom that is Cl. Cl, chlorine is the central atom. Highest oxidation state means it is more acidic. If the chlorine atom is uh, oxidation state of the chlorine is greater then it is a strong acid. You see in HCl4 the oxidation state of chlorine is plus 7 HClO3 oxidation state is plus 5 in HClO2 oxidation state of the chlorine is plus 3 in HClO oxidation state of central metal atom chlorine is plus 1 hence HClO4 is the strongest acid among us this one hence answer D is correct next question number 9 Identify non-aromatic species among the following Sn, S4N4, S2N2, S3N3 minus S4N4, 2 minus. Here S2N2 is a singlet diradical which is aromatic. You see S4N4 has 6 pi electron and it is aromatic here S2 and 2 is aromatic they are asking non aromatic compound and S4 N4 also is a having 6 pi electron it is also an aromatic S3 N3 minus has benzene structure this is also an aromatic hence S4 N4 2 minus has 8 pi electron 8 pi electron means it is a, a non aromatic or anti aromatic so correct option is d s4 n4 2 minus question number 10 you see when back donation when back donation for a metal to co m co bond this is in carbonyl compound increases then option a both metal carbon bond and C triple bond O bonds become stronger both MC bond and C triple bond O length become shorter MC and bond and C triple bond O becomes weaker both MC and C triple bond O bond lengths become longer so here 
what is the answer is the correct option is the correct option is c m c bond becomes stronger and the c triple bond o becomes weaker we will see how it is listen here the synergic bonding interaction are, are present in metal carbonyls the sigma bond formed when lone pair of electron of carbonyl compound is donated to vacant uh, metal to form a pi bond the electron pair is donated to fill metal d orbital to vacant anti bonding pi orbital of carbon monoxide it in this involves the lateral overlap of orbitals due to this the electron density in the bonding of pi orbitals of co decreases and anti bonding pi orbital increases hence the strengthening of c oxygen bond decreases the strength of metal carbon bond increases here you see metal oxygen that's a metal atom when bonds with the co this metal atom is a electron donor and carbon monoxide is a electron pair acceptor hence metal carbon bond strengthens that is the bond increases whereas carbon monoxide Uh, carbon oxygen bond strength is decreases this was the correct answer so uh, next uh, we will meet on next video thank you